that whole idea came from, uh, believe it or not, a camping trip that our founder of HubSpot, Dharmesh Shah, went on with Elon Musk, where Elon Musk told him all about this idea of vector alignment and how it's the ultimate challenge for companies. And basically, Elon Musk's point was that everybody inside of a company uh, has energy and has, you know, um, impact uh, and they can vector that energy in a certain direction uh, and for the most part you look at a company most companies really have all these people who have energy and who are doing things are vectored in either slightly different or very different directions uh, and they're all everyone is kind of pushing against each other right and f kind of fighting each other with their energy even in small ways and when you are you know really a company of any any size but especially a small company when you're able to vector your energy all in the same direction uh, and really have a very strong identity where everyone kind of knows exactly you know who you are and what you do and the story you're telling and everybody has a lot of energy and focus around this idea uh that's the solution to this to this challenge of vector alignment and um okay it couldn't be more true you know i think when, even i see it at, i see it at hubspot i see it at small companies uh and when companies really have this alignment they have huge outsized impact mm-hmm Interesting views there, Marcus. So in the piece, you say that uh, every company needs to find an identity and your identity will help you align vectors, right? So how do you define that and how does it work? Yeah, so I think, you know, identity is kind of a, you know, maybe it's a proxy for like brand or culture. Um, I like the word identity just because it's like, you know, who, who we are and what we stand for and really what we're focused on. And I think that, you know, identity to me is really this idea of just kind of, you know, focus and energy and, and that being really tight and clear. Uh, and, you know, a lot of like culture can kind of happen if you don't let it and the same with brand. And so it's just being intentional about this, I think is really important uh, and really focusing on it, at, especially when you're starting a company and really understanding it and kind of creating it. Um, you do need to kind of, you know, build it based on the people who work at your company. Uh, but you can create an identity. And, and I think just most companies really don't think about it too much. And uh, yeah. the ones that do, I think um, it's clear that they do when it works, especially. Yeah.